Hello everyone, welcome back again to my channel. This is Teacher Mars. And today's video, we will discuss about illustrating the permutation of non-distinct objects. So what is permutation? A permutation refers to the different arrangement of objects in a definitive manner in which or the order of the objects is important. So two types of permutations, a permutation of objects in a line and a permutation of objects in a circle. So permutation of distinct objects and permutation of non-distinct objects are the two kinds of permutations of objects in a line. So what is permutation of non-distinct objects? So it is another type of permutation in a line in which objects are not distinct or not unique. Examples of permutation of non-distinct objects. So number one, arranging the letters of the word mathematics. So this permutation is non-distinct because there is a duplication of letters. So there are two M's, two A's, and two T's. So the second example is five vases of the same kind and three candle stands of the same kind are arranged in a line. So this is a permutation of non-distinct objects because there are objects to be arranged in a line that are alike or the same. So we have here a situation. So, example number one, finding the number of possible arrangements of the letters of the word three. So, the number of objects is four. So, discussion of the possible arrangements. Since the two is are the same, we can make a distinction between the two. Thus, let us use uppercase for one E and lowercase for the other E. So, the possible arrangements are... T R big E and small E, R E E T, E E T R, E T E R, T R E E, R E E T, E E T R, and so on. So now, these two E's are the same. Thus, 3 and 3 are also the same. Therefore, there are 12 possible arrangements of letters of the word 3. So, we can also use the fundamental principle of counting. And since there are 4 letters in the word 3 and there are 2 E's for each permutation like 3, the duplication is eliminated by dividing 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 is equals to 24, 2 times 1 for the 2e, so the answer is 24 over 2, so therefore there are only 12 possible arrangements of letters of the word 3, because 24 divided 2 is 12. So another example is displaying five flags in which three are red and two are yellow. So number of objects is five. So let R for the red flag and Y for the yellow flag. The possible arrangements of the five flags on display are RRRYY, RRYYR, RRYRY, R, Y, Y, R, R, and so on. So with the use of fundamental counting principle, since there are five flags in all and three red, red flags and two yellow flags consist of five flags, the duplication is eliminated by dividing five for the total flag so 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 is equals to 120. And 3 for 3 flags. 
So, 3 times 2 times 1 and for the 2 yellow flags is 2 times 1 which is equals to 12. So, therefore, there are 10 possible ways of displaying the 5 flags because 120 divided 12 is equals to 10. So, we have here an activity. So, direction, write check if the statement is true and write x if it is otherwise. So, number 1, 10589 is the 5 non-distinct digit pin of my phone. So, the answer is wrong. Because if we say that non-distinct, there must be um, the same number. So, since 10589 has no same number, so it is wrong. So, Number two, divide is the anagram for division. So, it is wrong because divide is different from division. So, there are seven ways to write in order the word arrange. So, wrong. One possible arrangement of odd is dad. So, it is correct. Number five, wherever is a permutation of non-distinct objects. So it is correct. Six, everywhere is not a permutation of non-distinct objects. So everywhere, is it distinct or is it true or it is not true? So the answer is wrong. So, number seven, it takes 100 ways to arrange the letters of the word letter. So, wrong. Number eight, one possible arrangement of the letters of the word multiplication is multiply. So it is wrong because Y does not found in the word multiplication. So, number nine, there are 12 possible arrangements of letters of the word room. So, that is correct or true because that is. Number 10, five persons lining up does not involve permutation of non-distinct objects. So, is it correct or not? So, it is true. So that's all for my vlog today. This is Teacher Morris and everything is simple unless you make it complicated. Thank you very much. See you in my next